Hello everyone, I'm Himanshu from Interazo. We are here at Aparna Kanopi Lotus, Hyderabad to showcase our 3BHK interiors of an individual house. In the entire living area, there was no space available for the entertainment unit. All the walls are having windows or doors. And we wanted to partition living and dining area. So we have created a partition with a white brick cladding along with a veneer work and open ledges for artifacts. In the base unit, we have given a 40 mm thick veneer work along with drawers, which has a quadro runners with push to open. That means your side channels are not visible. And we have done a periphery fall ceiling for better lighting along with diffused cove lighting. Let me show you the dining area now. We are in the dining area now. Over here, we have done a periphery gypsum ceiling along with peak veneer ceiling with a matte polish finish. Over here in the crockery unit, we have given a couple of drawers with push to open and no side channel visible. We have given wall unit with Bloom Aventos HKS lift up system. Tall units for storage. With lighting inside. Some more drawers over here. Again, a wall unit with Aventos HKS lift up system. Let me show you the kitchen now. We are in the kitchen area now. Over here, we have done an entrance veneer paneling with two spotlights. Inside the kitchen, we have used Caesar stone countertop with a Caesar stone wall dado. Over here, we have used half from Halfley and a chimney, Teresa I-90 and VRT-490. Under the hob, we have used three Lagra boxes from Bloom, one for cutlery, another one for cup and saucer, Another one for plates. Next to it, we have given two more Lagra boxes for storage. Each of the Lagra box can carry 40 kg weight capacity. Right of the hob, we have given a bottle pullout for spices and oil bottles. Next to it, we have planned a magic corner to use the corner space effectively. Unit, we have given HF lift up system from Bloom which can be stopped at any height and very much useful for low height users. We have given an easy access corner in the wall unit with soft close hinges from Halfley. Next to it we have given HK top lift up system along with a dish drainer for cup and saucers or plates. Under the sink, we have given a dustbin. Let me show you another side of the kitchen. Plant a couple of tall units and back side of the tall unit, we have also given a space for the store area, which is another staircase. Over here in the tall units, first we have planned a built-in refrigerator from Halfley which has a 300 liter capacity. Next to it, we have planned a pantry unit from Bloom. This is tandem box pantry. Each drawer can carry 30 kg weight capacity. So totally we have five drawers over here and weight capacity will be 150 kg in total. Next to it, we have a built-in microwave and a built-in oven and a wicker basket. On above of it, we have planned a storage area with Aventos HKS. Next to it, we have given some storage space with veneer cuboid and some, you know, door and shelves over there. Next to it, we have planned a space to go in the store area. And this entire kitchen we have done with imported acrylic shutters, which we have imported from Austria and it is brand is called Sanusan. We're in the master bedroom now. Over here, we have done a periphery fall ceiling along with teak veneer ceiling with some spotlights. We have planned L-shaped wardrobe with floor to ceiling phoenix shutter. And these are from Italy. Basically, there is no joint in the entire shutter. Over here, 
we have used Haplay Classic Duo Soft Open and Soft Close Sliding Mechanism. So soft open means while opening the shutter, it doesn't bang while opening side. We have used draw systems without side channels and soft close. Over this L side, we have made it very easily accessible corner so that you can access your L shaped wardrobe very easily. Again, we have given a couple of drawers without the side channels visible. We have also planned a jewelry pullout without velvet. And you have, can have your finger rings, earrings over here, and some watch over here. We have also planned a pullout mirror. And in this mirror, you can see yourself from foot itself. In the master bedroom, we have planned a study table with the Fenix top. Fenix is pretty good material for a steady top, it's anti-fingerprint, anti-scratch. You can't even scratch with your nails. Even if you scratch it with fork, you can thermally heal it. Over here, we have planned storage with quadro drawers and soft clothes. We have planned wall unit and with some ledges and a profile light. Over here, we have given HKS. Let me show you bathroom now. We have done a uh, shower partition with Senko being 10 on the front glass along with Hefley hardware. We are in the sun's bedroom now. Over here, we have a walking portal area. We have given an entry door. We start this. Inside the walking model, we have created a model space to have a shutter. We have given profiles over here with shelves for stacking, with drawers, with the hand section, with jewelry to lock, for watch and wallets, and finger rings, with the basket for laundry, and a hanging space for hanging clothes. Above the area, you can use it as a loft. Each shelf can carry 50 kg to weight capacity. Over here, we have given a complete full size of the Let me show you the TV in the next video. Now, now. it's a little bit of a TV unit with Fenix finish. We have given a draw with the side channel. Over here, we have got two single drops for the unit, and these are the heading part of the channels, which is under one channel. We are in the end now at the floor. Over here, we have designed some ledgers with the frame action, and we have given a profile lighting. This can be used in multiple ways can be used in a bookshelf, can be used like with wireless speakers, and etc. Let me show you. A bedroom set up of floor. We are in another bedroom now. Over here, we have also planned a walk-in wardrobe with profiles with the stone finish lining from green here. We have a couple of drawers over here for storage with ledges to the stack of clothes. Each ledge can be 50 kg with capacity and a first space for a loft. Over here, we have given a hanging space and again with the jewelry pull out in the little basket. Yeah. We have done a TV unit along with a study room with some bookshelves over here and open ledges with a profile lighting. We have given two more drawers of storage in the living unit. Let me show you the sit out area now. We are in the sit out area now. Over here, we have planned a storage unit, which is again completely handleless. The soft close hinges. Over here, we have planned a different fall ceiling along with vineyard ceiling lightings. This is it from a completely new interior. Thank you for watching.